Russo'sBrand.com, where the pros are the pros. See, and like even even this guy's like, you know, when we're talking about the Pritchards and the this this guy and all these freaking guys, bro, all, all of them need to go. Like they all need to go. Because I'm 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 watching, bro, Chance and Carter. First of all, bro, two things. Number one, I don't know who's who. And number two, I don't care. I don't care who's Chance and I, I don't care who's Carter. I don't care. Then you put them next to Chelsea Green and Piper Niven, who definitely have charisma, character. Obviously, Piper Niven, you know, is a is a physical specimen. Chelsea Green is sexy and funny and entertaining. And you're going to tell me you put these four girls next to each other and you're going to back the Carter and Chance horse? Whoa, I, I mean, my God, you know nothing about talent. If that is the decision you're making, you know nothing um, unless, bro, somebody's got a crush on one of these two girls in the back. My God, come on, Ben. You line these four girls up. As you say, Ben, where's the money? Where's the money in these four girls? The money's at the club. These guys have been there forever. Hunter and Sean and all these freaking guys. And you're going to tell me the money is in Carter and Chance and their whoop whoop. And their finish was definitely not in the money when oh. she dropped both knees right into her sternum when it should be a cross body. So we've got a lot, a long way to go to be safe in the ring, uh, you know, as opposed to what we rehearsed in NXT 150 times in a row. Um, but yeah, it doesn't make sense booking wise because you'd want to keep heels on top to have the baby faces to overcome. However, in WWE, they think put the, put these belts on them and with the marks that instantly makes them credible when that, all that really does is lower the quality of your belts and what your champions should be because you're just using it as a, a shiny prop to go look at these girls, but you better be careful when you put the spotlight on somebody and they can't deliver in their finish and might be hurting other talents. So, we got a lot to work on. I mean, that it's not those girls' fault. They're given too much way too fast, right? So you got you're you're kind of being set up to fail um and not be built properly. Really, you'd want heels to keep going over, going over, going over, going over until they finally get them. So now they've got the belts and the heels are either gonna look stupid how many times, or they're just gonna take it off them and then they've lost the belts in six weeks and they really weren't champs to begin with back yourself into a corner on that one yeah, and then stevie my favorite part of the show <laughs> let's fly all the girls in so we could oh, shoot I them in the that. I was like, oh they, they, bro, they, how, how, listen, how, they watch this bro how can how can somebody like listen i like natalia i really do and congratulations to her she just celebrated 17 years but how can somebody like an natalia say are, are you shitting me like Person. how how many times are you gonna fly us in to be sitting there watching a freaking monitor? First of all, I really do, do take issue with the word celebrate attached to spending 17 years in WWE. I don't think <laughs> you should celebrate that. Um yeah, when I watched that, I jumped out of my chair and was like, oh my God, Russo's gonna they're ribbing Russo now. Next week is gonna be 12 or 14 of them just sitting around and acting like they're and that's the funny part is like you can tell that they they even have to act like they're interested in the show. <laughs> they're acting like it's all the like you know, they're like really like things are really high stakes. By the way, speaking of high stakes. I think what was worse than the finish was them trying to do that hurricanrana to Chelsea Green mm. off the top. I mean, mm. this is where, dude, people are going to get killed someday or paralyzed. And really, we haven't talked about that a whole lot lately. But there's a real chance that this is going to happen. We we're going closer and closer to that point. I swear, you know, Ben. I'll, I'll, you know, I, I know Ben doesn't like any sitcoms with a laugh track, so he's not going to like any of the sitcoms that are my favorite. But. Uh, and, uh, you know, the queen, of, the, the the king of queens, bro, you know, he works for like UPS. Mm -hmm. Every time they go to UPS, they got the one shot of that red car outside the building, like every single time they cut to the UPS building. Bro, why don't they tell those girls? 
bro, bring five different sets of clothing and we're just going to shoot the same scene five times. I don't know. You, you know how much money they will save doing that, bro? If they get the girls in the locker room with the monitor and they change their clothes for five weeks in a row. Bro, they're saving tens of thousands of dollars doing it. It's got to be a rib. It's got to be a rib. It's got to be somebody complaining about not being on TV. Could I, could I interject with Absolutely. Your, your, your theory just a few minutes ago? Do the writers, do every one of those girls that are in that locker room have a writer who has a crush on them and wants to see them? Bro, I swear to God, once I, I, so, somebody told me this, um, and it was one of the boys, and I don't really want to say who it is, but it was it, it was high level. I mean, it was, it was a former champion, okay? Former champion, Raw Prime, former champion. He basically told me, bro, during Alexa Bliss's run, that like there was one particular writer that was just following her around everywhere she went like a freaking little errand boy. So, yes, yeah, Stevie, I, I mean, seriously, because I, I've asked the question a million times. What, why is Indy Harwell on this roster and being paid? I've asked it a million times, bro. So, yeah, you you know, you know, some of that crap is going on. Could be, and uh, it has in the past, so there's there's reason to believe that it is. I don't know if it's that. I think it's even possibly worse, but there is no next week. <laughs> we got to have them here just in case we rewrite something because we don't have a roadmap of what we're doing. for we. What do we got in the can? The R-Truth thing that we spent 16 hours on this week and the opening promo moment. Like, no thread line through, no... Like who wants to see Miz versus JD McDonough for two commercial oh, breaks? God, bro. That to me shows it. And then yeah. that that all these girls are back there. They're like, oh, we'll cut to them. Like they think they're brilliant instead of doing what you said and saving forty grand this week, right? And and putting it back into the product where it could. I, I don't think they even know what, who's going to be there next week or where where they want to go with it. There is no. And we cut away to women's locker room like six weeks of scripts ahead week four. And then we show the women here and she reacts this way. There's none of that. You know, it's funny about that. First and foremost, about what you just said, oh, I had it in my mind. Oh, yeah. They're, that scene is saying that the whole world's watching this match because it's so important. Hmm. But nobody watches TV at the same time. So. Above that, too, I would love, this would be great wrestle crap if they did try to do your suggestion with four to six weeks of different backstage stuff and they forget, and the girl that's wrestling in the ring is also is in. Oh, yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, That'd be like, phenomenal. Please do that. That would be the greatest That'd moment. That would be ever. phenomenal. What about this, Ben? What about or, or they they start like catching on that it's that, and like girls start bringing in mannequins and dressing them as themselves, yeah, and like put them in put them in the fucking thing. They cut to the back, and it's all mannequins just watching the fucking monitor. Well, at, least, at least they're giving Nikki Cross a break. <laughs>